Da -da now it's five o'clock on this February 16th, 2014 on a Sunday evening. It's time now for the Waterman Jester PJ Wiggins. The evening work. Sunday evening. February 16th, 2014. Good evening, everybody. Good conditions at five o'clock in North Message to the guy. Temperature 30 degrees with air skies with humidity of 39 percent wind speed. West about 7 miles per barometer, 20 minutes, 3 inches, two about 8 degrees. Visibly 10 miles and wind chill 23 degrees. Okay, let us take a look at our radar, radar scope bit of shows. A couple of little, bit, little snow showers in southwestern Berkshire's in Massachusetts, down for 72, New York, down for southwestern Connecticut, down for Waterbury, down for Stamford, and then stretch on in northern New Jersey, and down in the north. Eastern Pennsylvania and the cloud stretch of the down, snow stretch of the down for West New York, down for Eastern Ontario, and the snow showers stretch of the down for Southeastern Pennsylvania, down to Central and Western Pennsylvania, down for Maryland, and down for Northwestern Virginia, and Slade Rain showers down for North Central portions of Virginia, and then after back to the snow showers and Northeastern Maine, and down for New Brunswick, down for Nova Scotia, and Spain Slade snow showers Western and Central portions of Prince Edward Island there. And rain cleaning should snow showers in the eastern Prince Edward Island there. Snow showers in eastern Quebec. And in the snow showers, search of the West Virginia and Danfu. Northeastern Ohio, Danfu, Mich Central, Southeast Michigan, and Detroit, and Central Michigan, and Northeastern portion of Indiana, and Danfu, Northwestern portion of Ohio. Snow showers in North Central portion of Iowa, Danfu, West Central portion of Minnesota. Snow showers West Central portion of Minnesota, Danfu, Northeastern. And eastern portions of no, North Dakota down for southern Manitoba down for southeastern portions of Saskatchewan here. Snow showers in northern portions of Saskatchewan and eastern portions of Alberta and then search down for Alberta it's down for eastern portions of British Columbia. Rain showers in the east central portion of Arizona. Rain showers in the north central portion of Mexico. And sleet and rain and snow showers in Utah and Colorado stretching out of Wyoming and Danfu. Montana and Danfu. Southern portions of Idaho. Rain showers in the eastern portion of Montana rain, rain showers in western Oregon and Washington State with sleet and snow showers in Washington Cascades Olympic Mountains of Washington and Tampa Mountains of Southern British Columbia. Toss the North Dakota. Good evening, 18 degrees with overcast skies here. Okay, and let us take a look at our ray satellite little bit shows. Back to the cloud from Southern New England, stretching it down for the Southern New York and Pennsylvania, and the Virginians, and stretching down the Great Lakes, and the back to the clouds from Northern Virginia, and then on cloud, stretching it much in the central and northern plains, taking out for the Northern Rockies and down in the northwest, and the back to the clouds from Montreal, stretching it much in Manitoba, Saskatchewan, Alberta, and down in British Columbia. Back to the clouds from Quebec, and stretching out in Atlanta, Canada. And the back to the clouds down for Northern Mexico, down in Southern Arizona, and down for Northern portions of Mexico, and down Southern portions of California. Here. And about to class from Southeast Supports, Louisiana, and then up to Texas. Okay, let's take a look at our map situation here. High pressure centered in northwestern portion of New Mexico, down from Southeast Iowa, down from central portion of the Gulf of Mexico here. And a cold front from Southern California, stretching in Nevada, down to Utah, down to Colorado, down to Wyoming, and pink front from Eastern portion of Montana, and a stationary front from Saskatchewan, warm front down for Central Alberta. Cold front down to Mexico, and Texas cloud with a warm front over Texas, and down for Southwest Louisiana. Cold front, that's in Nova Mississippi, Alabama, and Georgia, and Central Western Carolina, and a pink front down for Western Virginia, and warm front Nova Carolina. Warm front up. The seven tip of water to see low pressure in, in Pennsylvania and low pressure center of subwestern Saskatchewan. 32 degrees out temperature around in Boston, it's 37 in Washington, D.C., 63 in Atlanta, 37 in Miami, 80 out in Brownsville, 73 in Dallas, 34 in Kansas City, 27 in Chicago, 18 in Minneapolis, 43 out in Great Falls, 46 in Seattle. 16 in San Francisco, 66 in Los Angeles, 45 in Salt Lake City, 66 in Denver, and 16 in Albuquerque. Okay, regional temperatures. It's 32 out in Boston, it's 30 out in Bedford, 31 out in Beverly, 30 out in Gloucester, 31 in Taunton, 31 in Bedford, 32 in, in Buzzard Bay, 32 in Mars Avenue, 31 in Nantucket, 3 in Robinstown, it's 3 in Providence, 28 out in Smithfield, 32 in Wesley 3 in Block Island, 30 out in Field and Milford, 30 out in 
it's just a little more boring as Bedford 3 1 in Beverly, 3 in Gloucester, 25 in Webster, 26 out in Sturbridge, 24 in Worcester, 30 out in Lemster, 26 in Springfield, 25 in Annapolis, 28 out in Greenfield, 21 in North Adams, 18 in Pittsfield, 22 out in Albany, New York, 29 in New York City, 31 in Islip, 30 in Montauk, 30 in Bridgeport, 31 in Waven, 33 in New London, it's 26 in Hamburg, 27 out in Waterbury, 29 in Meriden, 29 in Oxford, 27 out in Windsor Locks. 20 in Bennington, 25 in Keene, New Hampshire, 3 in Nashua, New Hampshire, 26 in Manchester, New Hampshire, 20 in Potsdam, New Hampshire, 25 in Cochrane, New Hampshire, here. Okay, let's take a look at our HBC forecast discussion here. And it shows. A number of rain and snow for the central and eastern United States, remaining in Nashville, Oregon, and Pennsylvania, Northwest. The polar vortex will remain at high latitude in Canada at this period, that close to the northern pole. This pattern leads to an average to above average temperatures for the lower 48 and minimal threat for heavy precipitation in East Iraq is then due to dense slope flow and minimal inflow from the Gulf of Mexico. Precursor system will be on the march from west to east across the contingent United States. The pattern should be persistent in a work week. For starters, that tight pressure gradient on the southwestern side of a deepening storm system moving across Atlantic Canada will cause gusty winds over New England the day before. More tranquil conditions arrive on Monday over the seven plains. The next surface low is for to be forecasted to take shape and then move towards the lower Great Lakes by Monday night. That's expected to bring mainly light to moderate snow. From the upper Midwest, uh, the Great Lakes and northern Middle United States, and with shots and tons from slated for the portions of the lower the middle Mississippi Valley and deep south. And light sleet and freezing rain is possible across the Midwest from eastern New Nebraska across southern Iowa, northern Missouri, and portions of the lower Ohio Valley. And warmer weather to be expected along a day after this storm passes and the storm system passes its by its upper level ridge is expected from the beginning of the work week. Southern Texas in particular, which remains within the warm sector of the systems by its north, is expected to be warmer than the 80s. Uh, Tuesday afternoon, at west, sustained moisture flow uh, along with frontal passages from the Pacific are expected to keep conditions unsettled across the northwest and the northern Carolina Divide with widespread moderate to occasionally heavy precipitation for Tuesday, most of the precipitation should be in the form of rain and lower elevations and snowfall for the higher elevations here. Okay, let us take a look at our forecast discussion here. High pressure building in from the west will bring mainly but dry but really cold weather for Monday night. Another storm is possible Tuesday and Tuesday night bringing some accumulated snow into the region of milder and then still pattern. Period is possible for late next weekend, for time it is uncertain. New term until 6 a.m. Monday morning. Wind chill dropped to 0 to 10 below 0 in most locales by daybreak Monday. A moisture star of short wave will be sliding to our south this evening with a little moisture available, no more than perhaps a passing for a light snow shower. A two south of the mass term out this evening is to include. Should be clued after midnight from west to east, except for perhaps some ocean vex clouds across the outer Cape Nantucket. Nantucket. Otherwise, dry and very cold weather tonight under a strong cold wind infection and low temperature should be. Mainly me in the single district across the interior with the lower the middle teens on the coastal plain enough wind will remain to result in a wind chill of valves dropping to below zero and ten below zero. And it looks like conditions will fall just short of wind chill advisory criteria. So no headlines planned here. Oh. Okay. Let us take a look at our 784 cast. And it goes like this. For the night, a slight chance of snow showers between 9 p.m. and 11 p.m. Most sky skies and gradually becoming mostly clear skies, a little over 11 degrees. Northwest wind about 7 to 9 miles per chance of precipitation, 20%. Washington's birthday, sunny with iron, 29 degrees. Wind chill valves as low as 0 degrees. Northwest wind about 8 to 11 miles per hour, with winds gusted as 23 miles per hour. My night increased costs with a low around 14 degrees calm wind. So there's no likely mainly between 11 a.m. and 4 p.m. Most of the clouds behind here. 37 degrees. Light of variable wind becoming southwest east about 6 to 11 miles per hour in the morning. Chance of precipitation is 70%. New snow accumulation 1 to 2 inches is possible. Yes. Tuesday night, a chance of snow mainly before 9 p.m. And the podcast got low in 25 degrees. West wind about 8 to 10 miles per hour coming southwest at midnight. Chance of precipitation is 30%. And Wednesday, scattered showers. Mainly between 1 p.m. and 2 p.m. Most of the clouds behind here. 43 degrees. Chance of precipitation is 30%. What's that? Bolsa Clouds got low in 29 degrees. Thursday, Bolsa Clouds got down here 43 degrees. For that, a chance of rain, Clouds got low in 35 degrees. Chance of precipitation of 40%. Friday, rain likely, Clouds got down here 51 degrees. Chance of precipitation of 60%. Friday night, Bolsa Clouds got low in 31 degrees. Saturday, Parts of Clouds got down here 46 degrees. Saturday night, a chance of rain, Bolsa Clouds got low in 31 degrees. And chance of precipitation of 30%. 
emphasizing a chance of rain, most of the tiny 45 degrees, sense of inspiration is 30 percent. Peters, what a phrase of the evening. A slight chance of snow with a chill in the air. This is PJ Wizard. Have you have a good evening with a good positive job. Be soon 11. Have a good evening.